set up. Let's see how this goes. Let me pause that. You don't want to hear my TV. Shut this noisy thing off. Alright. So, I've got Flight Sim World. Decided, well, let's start with a uh, mission. Well, I did, did just take a really short hop. Something you could drive in like 20 minutes here. Here in Tulsa where I live. Just quick Jones Airport to Tulsa International. Uh, other than fairly lowish F FPS... It's not bad. I don't see what everybody's complaining about. Uh, early access. I mean, it just came out today. And my lighter don't want to light. Come on. Well, what the hell. Guess I'll smoke later. Alright, let's see what we're going to do here. November Sierra Kilo, you are cleared on runway 7 left. Um, I'm on approach here. Where are my flaps? Well, I have no okay, flaps or uh, gear. this plane well enough to uh, Radio know what I'm doing here. <laughs> Got my settings on medium. I'm running 14 frames per second right now, but it's smooth. So I'm not unhappy about it. And this is while recording, so eh, I can't complain. Lowering flaps. All right, there's the lights. There we go. Roger, let's put her on the ground. Well, that's going to happen one way or another. <laughs> we'll be on the ground <laughs> one way or another. How's my speed look? I'll hold it right there for now. It's about 50%, maybe a little less throttle. runway over there not yet but I guess so not the one I was aiming at so I guess I gotta move over a little <laughs> line up with something different I thought I was lined up with that big old long line over there on the left but nope is that ramp or taxiway or something If you hear thunder, that's not in the game. It's actually here in town. <laughs> Been seeing some lightning and flashes and a little bit of thunder here and there. Don't know if it'll come through the mic. I overshot that a bit. Oh, so far, so good. Although I think I'm getting a little low. Let me raise her up here. So this is the first mission uh, that it had for me. I uh, just picked it at random, more or less. It was on the main uh, loading screen or menu screen. Uh, I had this as a mission, so I was like, "Well, what the heck? Let's try it." And I am low and getting slow. Lower than I want. Let me give it a little juice here. I can't even see the runway yet. I'm a little off. And I should be, yeah, almost. I can't see it. There it is. Well, that's not good landing. 
Alright, we're on the ground. Now what? Do I gotta taxi this thing or what? No, with flight school, you had to get under 20 knots on the ground for it to count, so. Would you usually. Alright, I'll go ahead and. So. There we go. That was easy enough. Still got to figure out my uh, all my settings for things like uh, you know which views I like and moving them around and stuff like that. Getting stuff on my other monitor. But yeah, as you see, it's not too bad. I I think I'm gonna enjoy this and I look forward to what they bring in the future. I mean, it just came out today. It's uh, you know open alpha th thing, early access. Um, so yeah, there's still a lot of work to be done. They're basically using us as beta testers and normally I get kind of pissy when they charge you to be a beta tester, but I didn't have to pay for it because I have flight school. Uh, so I'm not going to complain this time. <laughs> I, I just hope they don't go outrageous with the cost of add-ons and things like that. Uh, they've already been doing that with FSX. You know, the way I look at it, if you got a $20 game and you have an add-on that might add 1% to 5% more game and they charge as much or more than the game, I get a little pissy. I think the amount that the add-on brings to the game should be reflecting the price. Man, it's starting to really rain here. <laughs> but there you go. There's my first flight video for Flight Sim World. Hope you enjoyed it.